local reporting you can trust. You're watching KRQE News 13 at 4. Good afternoon. A trial for a series of cold case rapes that could have lasted two weeks has been cut short after the defendant, Edward Duran, changed his plea mid-trial. News 13's Chandler Farnsworth is in the newsplex with the latest. Well, in a surprise decision from the defendant, Edward Duran and his attorney told the judge today they wanted to change his plea from not guilty to no contest. Mr. Duran, at this point we've halted proceedings because I've been advised that you want to exercise your constitutional right to change your plea from not guilty to no contest to all of the charges in the second amendment indictment. Is that correct? Yes. The rapes happened in the 1990s. One victim testified she was sleeping in her bed when a masked man broke into her apartment in 1992 and forced himself upon her while her children slept across the hall. But Duran wasn't charged until decades later when untested rape kits were finally tested and genealogy results led investigators to Duran. DNA collected from a fork he used at an Albuquerque restaurant confirmed the connection. In court today, the judge asked Duran if he was confident in changing his plea. Duran said yes. Do you understand that you are giving up these constitutional rights and that we could go forward with this trial and all the others if you wanted to? Yes. And do you still intend to give up your right to a trial? Yes. Duran pleaded no contest to all 15 counts of rape he was charged with involving six victims. He faces up to 270 years in prison. Back to you. Thank you, Chandler. A sentencing hearing is expected to take place.